Yes, uh, former President Olusegun Obasanjo have spoken regarding the creation of his party or the creation of the party or alleged creation of the party that, uh, you know, there was an alleged story that the president, the former president, was creating, uh, you know, a kind of a political party ahead of 2023. Uh it's like he said, he has denied it. He said it is a lie that he has no plan to form any political party. Well, perhaps he must have seen those governors and they must have had a meeting here and there and whatsoever. But perhaps it might not be for the creation of another party. But obviously, you know, like Nigerians, the way Nigerian uh, news normally comes out, it always comes out like it is a lie. It is a lie. And at the end of the day, you actually see that there is no lie in all of this i've seen so many reports i've brought some report here that people just come hey it is a lie it has not happened and at the end of the day you just find out that it is truth and you don't come back here to even say hey uh, that report you gave was actually true but of course it is part of journalism but you know Obasan just case is you know like they will say there's no smoke without a fire Perhaps they had that meeting and, you know, some things came up and someone leaked that uh, 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 report of him creating a party. But since he has not obviously spoken it out, maybe that is why he's denying it, because he's saying he has no idea that he has totally, you know, get his hands off politics, that he's no longer interested in any form of political stuff in Nigeria. But let us get into the details and see uh, how true all of this was, because there, there was earlier reports that he met some go uh, former governors and uh, for the creation of a new party ahead of the 2023 presidential election. But let us find out more about this. Of course, guys, please enjoy, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, turn on the notification bell, like, and also share this video. All right, guys, don't forget this is Saffron Media and we are here to give you the best, the most trending, exciting, reliable and authentic happenings. So guys, stay tuned and let's get right into the details of this report. Yes, Abbasan just said it is a lie. I have no plan to form new political party. Yes, right here it says that uh, former President Chief Olujegu Abbasan just has disowned report that he is planning to form a new political party ahead of 2023 general elections. The former president, in a statement issued by his special assistant on media, Kende Akiemi, said, Obasanjo is in labor Afghanistan as a guest of President Ashraf Ghani. The publication in the media said the former president is floating a new party ahead of 2023 elections and has picked three ex-governors as coordinators. He said that the fabricated story hardly comes as a surprise because he has for some time now observed with bewilderment the efforts by some people to drag him into their political games. Upon hearing of this latest fabricated report, Chief Obasan just said, In my part of the world, when you say goodnight in a place, you do not go back there and say good evening. The one who reported that they may need to visit Yabalev and those who believed it can believe that their mothers are men. I'm done with partisan politics, but by my position in Nigeria and in Africa and without being immodest, and indeed, in the world, my door must be opened and it is open to any individual or group of individuals who want to seek my opinion, view or advice on any issue or matter and I will respond to the best of my ability without being part of that individual or group. If anything, Chief Olusegun Obasanjo's just political party today is the party of Nigerians facing insecurity unemployment, hunger, poverty, and various other challenging issues. It is the party of Nigeria which must be saved. Kept wholesomely united in peace, security, equity, development, and progress. Let those who want to use the back door to force Chief Olujegu Obasanjo to return to partisan politics respect his choice to remain a non-partisan statesman. 
On his part, the former president will continue to perform his role as a statesman focused on providing counsel, support or solutions wherever possible in Nigeria, Africa and indeed the world, the statement said. So obviously this is uh, Obasan just spokesman. Uh, rather speaking on his behalf because he said that Obasanjo is right in labor Afghanistan as a guest of the president of uh, the president of Afghanistan that is Ashraf Ghani and uh, he is not around rather his media uh, aide actually responded to that report and he said that the uh, former president has no intention of being partisan or running any partisan politics in Nigeria. Yes, you can say that again, running partisan politics, but that does not stop the fact that he has the right to create another party that would make a better Nigeria. That is why he is an elder statesman. It is their responsibility to ensure that we have a better Nigeria because they saw the Nigeria which the real Nigeria was. They see how things were. They saw how things changed and they are seeing how things are rather moving backward. So it is more of their responsibility to ensure that there is a better Nigeria, if you ask me. Yes, I think so. Unlike some Nigerians who do not even have an understanding of what is going on today in the country. So it is the really the responsibility of statesmen like Obasanjo and others to ensure that Nigeria is better. If he needs to create a new party, if he needs to do something, it might not even be political. But I believe guys like this should be able to speak the truth. Now the present administration is putting all blames on former presidents and others who really want to, who have ruled before, and they forget it is their responsibility to ensure that everything goes well in their tenor. You don't have to start taking Nigerians backward to plan whatever. All of this should really have to stop, especially with the, the President Mohammed Buhari's administration, because this is not funny any longer. Before, Nigerians just used to look at it and just you know look away but not anymore because it is getting more serious and lives are being lost and all of that so really now it is important that nigerians sit up uh the former president have actually said he does not have any intention of creating any party for uh the general election in 2023 so everyone should sit up rather and i believe that uh before 2023, there will be a lot of new parties, but I guess we should have, uh, you know, leaders who are ready to really serve the people, not just anyone. Well, guys, that is it. Thank you so much for staying tuned. Whatever you have to say, please drop it in the comment section. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Do have a pleasant time. Bye for now.